What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to our how to build a custom RSF 650 on a budget series. In this episode, we're going to be putting everything back together. So let's jump right into it. I got all my parts laid out and ready to go. This is the color scheme I ended up going with. Got this nice little color on the tank. Got the seat all custom made. As far as the seat, I didn't have a video for that because I already have a video on how to do that. I'll throw a link up here that you can check out if you're interested in making your own seat. Probably the best way. I know a lot of you guys go for that Suron seat, but it's not that comfortable. I like this one. So if you want to do this yourself, I'll put a link up so you can do it yourself. Got all my tools and my electronics over here. Let's start putting this thing back together. All right, look at this thing. So far it's looking, looking nice. Now we got to do the wheels. So let's jump into that and I'll show you how to do that. All right, so we got our new rotors. We just got to take away this old rotor. Out you go. These new rotors come with this spacer. We have to remove the spacer. This is that spacer. We're not going to be using it. Now for these screws, I'm going to put some uh, Loctite, blue Loctite before I put them back in. Just make sure to do that. So much better. Now I got to do the other wheel and we'll throw them on. Yo, Tom, what it do? <laughs> Woo! All done. Wow. That was a hell of a mission. But we're finally done. I got these triangle things that go in the tank, but after you paint your bike, putting these back on is like a death sentence. Will definitely ruin the paint job. So I'd rather give the bike a few days uh, extra to let that paint really cure on there good. And then I'll attempt to do that. But as of right now, I don't care for these. What I really care for is to make sure that it turns on and the motor is running. So let's give that a shot. All right. Woo-wee, baby! That is beautiful. So we're gonna go test this bike, but you're gonna have to come with me to the next episode to do that. This was the assembly process of this. I hope you guys dig the color scheme. I'll do a little close up of it so you guys can see all of the colors on here. The tank is all nice and got that sparkly situation happening. And I'm loving this color combo. Gonna see you guys next time where we test the top speed of this thing. Again, like I said, this is not gonna be the fastest razor in the world. This is a snack getting machine. And it's a beautiful snack getting machine. So make sure to subscribe. Help your boy out. That's the only way to let me know I'm doing a good job. Hit that thumbs up so we can beat that YouTube algorithm. Move us up the charts. You know what I mean? I try to always give you guys knowledge and know-how other than just me riding around. So I hope you guys appreciate that. But that pretty much does it for the assembly of this bike. I hope you guys dig it. Again, hit that subscribe and like, and I'll catch you on the next one where we test the top speed. Appreciate you guys watching. Peace!